to our second year. And what do uh, they do? Well, the Ray Scholarship Foundation is through EAA, and um, they gave each of these boys $10,000 to complete their aviation, their wow. flight, um, and their PPO. And For high so schoolers? Or um, how high do you schoolers, I think they have to be 19 okay. and complete by 19. And, um, yeah, so each of their chapters sponsored them, and um, Joe was already mostly there, so he um, was a little easier. And So you guys want to say a little something about the Ray Foundation? This is Matt. He's my friend. And he takes videos. I take videos and put them on YouTube. Yeah, so the Race, uh, the Race Scholarship Foundation is a scholarship program run by the EAA. Um, David Lighting's at the head of it right now, and it's uh, sponsored by the Ray Foundation. So they uh, they give about ten thousand dollars to certain chapters. I believe um, it's a hundred. They did a hundred chapters last year, yep. which we're all part of, and then a hundred chapters this year, which he ended up getting one. Yep. Yep. So, uh, and it's all for 19 and under or high schoolers? It's all for people. I've heard that now they're making it a little bit more spread out to people that are wanting to get through license. I'm not sure yeah. if there's an actual age restriction now, but uh, when we started off the, the first uh, graduates, I guess you could say, uh, we were told people that were in high school still wanting to learn to fly and stuff like that. So okay. You, they would let us get a glider license with it until we were up to sit between, I think it was like 14 to 16, a glider license was the only thing you could get. Once you're 16, you got the scholarship, then you could get it for the private pilot, which is what all of us are doing. All right, and what are you flying? What kind of airplane? Uh, it's a 2000 Skyhawk 172, uh, manufactured by Cessna in 1999, certified in 2000. So um, this is Herrick, November 5, 9 or 7 Sierra Papa. It's a nice airplane. And, uh, and you bought it yourself? Or your uh, family? My company bought it. Your company, okay. Yeah. And then I fly uh, an outdated airplane, <laughs> a 1946 Aronka Champ, it's a 7AC. Uh, my grandpa owned it, he got the parts, it was in parts originally in 1990. He, him and a couple of friends rebuilt it in 1993 and we've been flying it ever since. Awesome. I fly, fly a 1977 172N that I rent from the hangar behind the steerman over there. And Is that... Uh, How's it going? Is that a Four Fox Echo? Yes, it is Four Fox I'd Echo. I've flown that one. Yeah, it's sort of like this, but older, less horsepower, and more flaps. Yes, you, you're limited to 30. Yeah, 30 degrees. Here. I can okay. drop it so like you a can, rocket 40 degrees. You got a bigger payload than 2600. Yeah, we have uh, quite a bit extra payload. 300 more pounds or so? Yeah. And how about you? Do you fly something? Uh, so I'll be flying a uh, Cessna 172. And that'll be through Gateway Technical College this fall. I'm the second generation recipient of the Ray, the Ray Scholarship. Okay. And who's your CFI going to be? Uh, my CFI is actually going to be Craig Zarinski. He works for Gateway Technical College. Okay. Is Matt Borgart still over there? Yeah, Matt's actually still there. He teaches, I believe, another three students at the school at the moment. Okay. Uh, Craig has me and two other students. He was my CFI. All right. Thanks, guys. How's the corn, Al? Mm -hmm. <laughs>